What's going on y'all? She got D. Back at it again with another video. Just gonna show y'all real quick a little something, something that I'm about to whip up in the kitchen. Fried rice. Hopefully this uh, this can inspire individuals to uh, to give that a shot and to cook themselves. I feel like cooking is a very good skill to have. It keeps you from going out to eat fast food. You could see something that you like that you eat from a restaurant and you'd be like, yo, how do you make it? Look it up online and you just like, about your business and just go ahead and do that hopefully you know after y'all see this and view this it'll be cool so let's get to it y'all hit that subscribe hit the bell give me a couple likes shoot me a comment down below let me know what you think about this dish now mind you i'm gonna let y'all know right now there are many 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 different ways that you can make um fried rice you know, the people make them in different ways. This is going to be my version of how I make it. Big shout out to my executive producer, Jay. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. We're gonna do the damn thing, so. As you can see, got a bag of white rice. It's preferred to get jasmine rice, but I'm not gonna lie to you. Y'all know me, I'm I'm cheap. So that shit was uh, about like, what, $5 a bag? Five, six, seven dollars a bag? I'm like, no, nah, I'm good. Then we come over here. We got seasoning mix right here. You can also use uh, salt, pepper if you want. You can always add it for later. Got a good soy sauce. I went with the reduced sodium. Yeah, I'm just trying to be, gets a little healthy on that side. So, my fat self. Definitely need some eggs with that. I mean, got an onion. I will be chopping in just a second. For my mixed vegetables, I will be putting full bag of this in here. I might actually put a second bag in there, who knows. Um, but yeah, so that's all I got so far. Many months later. So I forgot one little bitty thing. When you cook the rice, you're generally supposed to cook the rice a day before or at least the morning of so that gives the uh, the rice time to just cool down. Kind of slipped up on that one. But hey, we're here now. So we are gonna get back to it. As we can see here, the rice is fully cooked. It's ready to go. I think I put about three cups. Yeah, put about three cups in there, rice. So we got that done. So now let's get cooking. So the first thing that we're gonna start off with is uh, we're gonna start off with our eggs. We're gonna get that ready to go. Um, have that on the side. I'm gonna take four eggs and uh, I'm gonna take four eggs. I apologize for my oh, that is just terrible. I'm usually, like, dope it. Oh, dope it. Oh. oh, gosh, I'm usually dope at doing this, but but oh, gosh, as you can see, this is just, just disgusting. Jeez Louise, y'all. Get it mixed up, get it in there. Get that thing go. I'm telling you, I can whip up a mean breakfast, though. Know. Let me tell you that right now. And since that's done, we're gonna put this on the side. Leave that alone for the time being. Next, we have our onion. Now, you do not need the full onion, so I took it upon myself to cut it in half, put one away, and dice the other half. There we go. Chop, chop, chop. Look at that. Them skills are A1, y'all. Stop, stop it now. That's just beautiful. Stop playing with the kid. That's just beautiful. Now, you will have some bigger pieces that are lagging a little bit, so do your due diligence and just cut the other pieces to fair size. Next, we have our vegetable oil. Now, you wanna have a couple tablespoons prepared. Here, I'm just winging it. You also wanna have your stove on high heat. Next, we have our eggs. Now you want to scramble these really, really, really well. You want to have good spacing throughout your fried rice. You don't want to have like these big old clumps here and there. So you want to get that going for yourself. And I would say color wise, you want to have them golden brown. Here we're putting in our rice. Now I'm looking back on this. You're actually supposed to put about like one to one and a half cups of rice. I did not use that whole three cups y'all. I'm sorry, that did not happen. Here we're going to put our onions in. Make sure y'all scrape the hell out of that board and get all the onions in the pan, y'all. Don't let one go to waste. Now, when it came to the mixed vegetables, I actually used half the bag. 
and my ass thought I needed two bags. Boy, was I off on that one, y'all. God damn. Now look, y'all, when it came to this soy sauce, that soy sauce, I would say maybe four teaspoons of the soy sauce. Because I did two, and I just wasn't feeling it. I was like, bump this. We just gonna drizzle this bad boy. I didn't like the color, so I needed to add a little bit more flavor to it, y'all. Then finally, we top it off with the seasoning mix. Make sure you hit that thing from the back, get all those spices out, and you're good to go. So, got the chance to whip it up real quick in the kitchen, show y'all what I do. We are about to taste the finishing touches. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Whew. Boy, that's, that's good right there. I'm a hot sauce type of person, so I would make it and actually put some like sriracha sauce in it or like some type of spice to it. Oh, but just for the fact of I'm making this for the first time, I just wanted to try it and see how it works. And now I know what to do for later versions for adding a little kick to it. I'm not going to the restaurant anymore. I'm good. I'm good, love. Yes. Woo. That's tough. Oh, that's, that's good. That's good. And that is it, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you make fried rice. I appreciate everyone who was able to, to look at this. I just wanted to share this with you guys. I appreciate the, the support with everybody. It means a lot. In the meantime, between time, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell, Give me a couple likes, comment in the sections below, let me know what you think, shoot an idea my way, shoot a recipe my way. Like I said, I'm not the best cook in the world, but you give me a recipe, you give me something, I, I definitely can make something shake. So, y'all let me know. It's your guy LA, I'm out y'all. Be safe y'all.